Come on. Although that will lose me those two towers. They have only 14 minutes. Just lost the two things doing damage for no gain. So even though they actually have two ways into the city now, nothing. Can't you just wait them out at this point? I can, that's what I'm doing. There's still 14 minutes to go. It's just kind of dull. That's the backstage, not the front. Uh, yeah, you're right actually, of course it is. I am an idiot. Because that's the stage. But it doesn't look like these are really entrances. So people probably come in through the stage, through here, past the stage, and then into the auditorium. Where they can then watch the uh, the show. Friends, Romans, countrymen, lend me your ears. And then whatever the rest of that. Quotas. Something about Caesar. What did I expect from a Total War AI? It's the first time this has ever happened. And I have a lot of hours in this game now. Actually, that's a good question. How many hours do I have in this game? Total War Attila, 309 hours. This is the first time it's bugged out this badly. Sure, the AI has the odd weirdness. But, um, whoops. This is the first time it's it's completely broken. I should play RPGs. I did do an RPG. I played Pillars of Eternity 1 for a while and did dreadfully. I mean, I'm sure if I put more effort into it in the same way that I eventually got Total War to the stage where people would watch it, um, which is a challenge. Actually, less so on Twitch. On YouTube, it's a sodding challenge. The versatile fighting at all on YouTube is ridiculous. Like, just introducing uh, Total War games, I was getting... maybe... 20 views regularly. When most of my series are doing well over 100. Not 200. Or in the case of Hearts of Iron, 1,000. Um, but I just kept on hammering at it. I was just like, watch this! Watch this! Watch this. Oh, please, please, just watch this. No, I'm going to make you watch this. Here, watch this. And eventually, uh, Total War now seems to do well. Oh, I took the gates back. Yay. Yay me. Um, to where it worked, but it's, it's a lot of work. Basically, you have to retrain the, the algorithms to say, hey, there's actually a different audience for this channel. Please, please push them towards me. Ready to serve, my lord. <laughs> hey, Republic of Play. You're joining me during a very, very bad moment. The AI has completely glitched out. Um, so I'm just waiting them out. There's only eight minutes to go. We've just been having a bit of a chat during it. I think it's a bad time for YouTube in general right now. Twitch is taking much of their viewer base. Yeah, it really is. Like, just... I don't know, some things, some very specific things, Hans of Iron, does really well on YouTube, but anything else just doesn't. I, I don't know whether it's a subscriber thing, I don't know whether it's YouTube just not pushing the uh, videos out, or just being extremely selective in what videos it pushes out and to whom. It's, it's a problem, though. I'm sure they'll fix it, YouTube is too big not to, but it's it's been a while now. And this is, like, on the, the tail end of the adpocalypse and the demonetization and stuff like that. Which has improved. I have to say, like, despite all the prophecies of doom and gloom with the demonetization, that, that has seemed to solve itself and very little gets uh, demonetized now. That said, revenues are way down. It's probably halved in the last six months, I'd say, YouTube revenue. 
that is bearing in mind I've, I've basically dropped Hearts of Iron recently though. And that used to be the, the, the biggest portion of my income. Well, one of the things which I'm pretty sure would get you demonetized is um, Kaiserreich, but from the other perspective. Which numerous people have requested that I play. I'm like, if there's anything that's going to get you demonetized, it's calling some that game on your channel. That mod. It's, it's a terrible name for a mod. And I'm sure someone in chat can guess which mod I'm talking about here. I don't particularly want to say it because I know that YouTube runs voice recognition as well. It's a great platform in your honest opinion, you just don't, they just don't know how to run it at all. Well, YouTube at the moment seems to be transitioning away from the small time content creators to the bigger ones and like, they're, they're basically seeing how well Netflix has done and wants to become Netflix. Which is a mistake, because Netflix has already kind of got that down, as does Amazon Prime. Uh, YouTube had a niche, YouTube was making a lot of money in that niche, but because of a lot of very negative media representation recently, they're kind of panicking, and because they're panicking, they're, they're just changing everything, trying to become a TV station, which they're not. And they're going to lose a lot of their viewers, and they're going to lose a lot of their creator base trying to do so. And I think long term, they will switch back again, because that is where all the content is generated, is small-time content creators, but yeah, they, they need to realize that. Netflix will be cut apart by Hulu and Amazon, Disney's going to pull all their content. Well, yeah, and that's one of the weaknesses that Netflix has, is they're subject to the whims of the big uh, TV stations, which if YouTube keeps going in this direction, they're going to be subject to the same things. But then again, Netflix is also producing a lot more of their own content and they've been pushing that pretty hard. Like Netflix, I used to watch Netflix all the sodding time because I had all the shows like Star Trek uh, that I wanted to watch. They're getting rid of more and more of that stuff, they're bringing in more and more of their own things. I'm just not as interested in that. Things like Breaking Bad, things like Black Mirror, things like uh, Orange is the New Black. I think those are all Netflix originals, aren't they? I love how this battle has just become a discussion now with Mordred. Well, it's kind of had to. Thankfully, we've only got a minute to go. But yeah, it's, it's, it's been rather slow going. <laughs> and we did manage to kill a thousand in the process. We lost 500, but we killed a thousand. I'm a little bit annoyed that we lost all the archers. Like, that was unnecessary. And the cavalry was just... I think that was actually a very good use of cavalry was to tie up all their siege engines, though it did also break the AI, so, eh. New segment, two with the Viking. Disney really are taking over the world, nobody is worried, it's weird. They have very, very good PR. One of my favourite kind of insights into Disney was the uh, epic rap battles of history between... Oh, what was it? it was the um, Muppets creator and Stanley. That one. A draw! You are fought to a standstill. The battle is a draw. Honour has been satisfied on all sides. Oh, no, it hasn't. And that was a really, really good show of uh, ep epic rap battles. Highly recommend it. And the way that um, a certain third party comes in. It's clever. Outsmarted the AI so much that they broke. <laughs> well, I guess this is confirmation that stuff like Skynet will never happen. At a critical juncture, the AI will just break. I'm going to take the replenishment. That's a lot of replenishment. Oh, we killed the uh, wolf coats. Like, dead, dead. Nice. 
So Augusta Trevorum lives for another day. Or does it? Or do they still siege it? Stay sieging it? Not sure. Alright, so the Huns have split up. What's Eastern Rome doing? Yeah, Eastern Rome's just going off to North Africa because they see all the territories that, have, that I've lost there. Where was that battle? That was in France. No, nope, Milan still hasn't fallen. Um, yeah, n no. Just no. Commander. Cyber Cruise. This is a fight I will need to do, although <laughs> ah, I'm gonna be doing this with 120 men. If this was an actual garrison, I'd be able to win this one. Oh, it's because it was a converted. Hmm. I'm going to... Auto resolve this. I have too few men to really matter. Defensively. Alright, well I guess the navy is going to turn around and retake this place. I didn't realise it was so weakly defended. Some bitch. Desperate measures, in this case securing loyalty, is proving quite difficult. Unfortunately, and ugly though it is, more drastic measures may be required. So, we can castrate him, which makes him super loyal. We blind him. We forget about it. I'll castrate the bastard. Ooh, hello? We've got one of the slowdowns, which seems to be happening more and more regularly. There we go. Right, so now he should be super loyal. The Alamans and the Huns are at war. That's good. Medioladium still hasn't fallen. Turns remaining before surrender four. Why does that keep resetting? That's not the first time that's happened. There is just an Onaga defending this place. That's it. We hunger for battle. Oh, if only I had some legions over there, we could just kick their ass right now. Ready, willing, and able. All right, Navy. I need you to head over to Syracuse and take it back. None shall pass. Really? You think there's such a low level, ch low chance of me taking this place? Alright, let's do this! Amphibious Assault, these are always fun. Keep breaking siege and restarting, I don't think so. Dry, that's good. Okay, so they do still have towers, although the only one of any danger is this one, which is good because I have a lot of artillery. 
No, 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 no. Let's get the archers over there. With the assaults here. And the boss man there. Alright, start. Though actually, you lot do not fire unless I give you permission. this off. The odds are against us. We are outnumbered. There's your range there. Set Let's bring you up to here. And we'll shoot the uh, tower. We'll destroy it. So... My intention is. Right, I've already told you not to fire, so we're going to stand there. I'm going to bring the ships that I'm sending over here to go and block off this headland while I land the rest of my forces in here and then we just bombard them. And if we can trap them in here, that'd be great. They've blocked it off themselves. They can't actually get out of this arm. Oh, they're. <laughs> God, give us strength. Well then. Have at them. The only unit that can defend is this one. All of these guys are trapped. That's hilarious. What I could even do if I wanted to is stick archers over here. Oh, AI, what have you done? It's the second time! They're not exactly having a good time of it right now, are they? No, you can't reload. These. Oh, that was close. No, you can't reload ammo ships, unfortunately. You can, however, reload archers. Oh, you are kidding me. I went through that little gap. Continue firing. <sighs> All right, seriously, you artillery ships reported. Uh, artillery men, watch your targets. All right, about that's probably going to be too short. Oh, okay, way too short. Okay, that's actually surprisingly hard to hit. I need to move that ship a bit. Ammunition stocks restored. Let's move you. Like the there. We await your command. Pick your targets, men. Artillery ships ready. Right, let's try again. Alright, 
We're too close. Yes! Finally! We have destroyed right. the enemy tower! Fire at that. Let's try flaming shot. They're trying to break down the barricade. I don't think they can because it's their barricade. <laughs> no. Okay, I can't see anything. Oh, that'll do it. Well, that'll do it. Your orders? Set all, Commander. Move out. Actually, you know what? You three. Spent his ammunition. The enemy settlement burns. Ready the ammunition. Now watch as I nail one of my own ships. Sorry. Sorry. My bad. These things are harder to aim. Yeah, I shouldn't be allowed near the, uh, the the catapult trigger thing. How badly are you hurt? <laughs> you almost sank you. Oh dear, yeah, put that, put that fire out quickly. Yeah, let's let's not sink my uh, archer ships. Oops. Oh, we can't land on this side. We can only land here. Ammunition stops restored. All right. In that case. Don't be ramming my ship now. That's the one that's already half dead. Dude, careful. Thankfully, I don't think you can friendly fire with uh, rams, which is a good thing. Friendly fire with archers, though? That's a different matter. Take out our general! Def 
Enemy units have rallied and returned to the battle. Keep firing. Ammunition replenished. Now here's a question. Can I use their barricade? Destroy it. No, seriously, stop. Guys, no, god. Guys, stop. Um. Okay, apparently you can't stop them attacking a barricade when they've started. Time to land then. Oh, now they've stopped. Have they? I just don't know anymore. Oh, now you're on the barricade, which is what I was trying to get you to do in the first place. Are you having a laugh? Because what I was trying to do was get them to go on there because they've actually got ranged weapons. So I was just going to stand up here, fire a few shots off, and then go and take their center point for the extra morale. Oi, thought I told you lot, stop firing, so stop. No, guys, seriously. Stop. There it is, victory, right? Ready for battle. Really? Going. What's going on here? 